And here's a container idea using old farm crates. So I really wanted to maximize our garden space this year. Um, you know, we grow a lot of vegetables and can them and freeze them, but with a virus going on, especially earlier when we didn't really know what was happening, I really wanted to grow even more um, food. So I added this row here and I, I sewed these liners out of some vintage fabric just to give some color and some interest, make it kind of cute and fun. So same idea as the other um, container gardens, the locker and the file cabinet gardens we've done. Um, some styrofoam on the bottom, multiple layers of cardboard, um, our composted dirt. Um, so that's right along our back step area here. And then we added a couple more. We added one inside the back gate here next to this file cabinet garden. And then I added a couple here um, next to the gate, next to the garage, um, right off this garden area here. Again, upcycled some fabric that I had um, in my studio. It used to be a bed skirt and then it was drapes for a minute and a half. Um, and another one of our favorite um, expandable trellises on some bamboo poles. Fits perfectly right here. Um, I've got cucamelons, ground cherries, a couple sunflowers in here. Yeah, it looks like there's a squash peeking up too. So simple ways to um, add in some extra gardening square footage. And actually, I just thought of one more on the way. I also tucked one in over here just by the back patio door. And this one has some kale and some lettuce that I've been cutting and some chard. So that one fits there super perfect. So anyway, just sneaking in places to grow more veggies um, with these really simple ideas. So the crate gardens, they're kind of temporary. They're um, probably a year or two because the wood is pretty thin. So um, I did this a couple years ago and they were pretty rotten on the bottom by the next season, but that's fine. You know, cheap, easy to find, or I already had them in this case for um, vintage display and they work great.